It's execution battle taking a new twist tonight. We now know Joseph Wood was injected with drugs 15 times, and the entire death penalty system is now under review. ABC 15's John Erickson is live, and John, after that two-hour execution coming into question, firing squads are being discussed. Well, Steve, the Department of Corrections emphasizing to me that state lawmakers will decide what any future executions look like. If the legislature decides firing squads is the best way to go, then that could be what we see. We asked Wood's attorney if a firing squad would have been better for his client. It took pages and pages to list the 15 times Joseph Wood was given lethal drugs during his execution. The prison records just released to one of Wood's attorneys, Dale Bache. The experiment did not work. Uh, the Department of Corrections was experimenting with this uh, drug combination, and uh, the Department of Corrections kept giving dose after dose after dose. Now, the way Arizona put Wood to death is under independent review. According to a Department of Corrections spokesperson, nothing is off the table for this review, even possibly a return to firing squads. That's if the legislature decides that's the best option. Would it have been more humane, do you think, for Mr. Wood to be put to death by firing squad than the way he was? Well, that's not for me to say. That's for the Arizona uh, legislature. The Department of Corrections released a statement saying, in part, that Wood was sedated from shortly after the first injection through the time of his death almost two hours later. The records also showed that the director called the attorney general's office for a contingency plan after 14 doses hadn't worked. But after the 15th dose, that plan wasn't needed. Wood was dead. It's unclear how long it will take to finish that independent review. The Department of Corrections has committed to transparency, though, they say, in the process. I know this investigation is still playing out as well. Thanks so much, John.